fighting just like a soldier I keep on moving forward Always getting closer I'm marching till it's over like a soldier, I can't live in that world. Always getting closer, marching to the top. I'm just like a soldier, I can't live in that world. Always getting closer, marching to the top. What's up, guys? Welcome back to XCOM 2: War of the Chosen playthrough. Episode 77 Planet Blind, Iron Man and Commander Difficulty With the added little twist of all of my squad mates being friends of mine Making it a bit more impactful, emotional Just that much more important to keep them safe, you know and Just to recap last episode, it was a Haven Strike Without Hayden He's a bit tired. We're all a bit tired. Episode 74, I think it is. Maybe 75. Tired everybody out somewhat. And if you saw it, <laughs> you'd know why. But yeah, it was a Haven Strike with no medic. Which is never fun. I almost got blindsided and almost had to send Tomo a eulogy. Well, right up eulogy for Tomo, I mean. Got flanked by what I thought was a squid, squidly fella. What I call gatekeepers, but it turns out it had a, some huge laser beam on it. So I think it was some sort of magical gatekeeper. But anyway, we survived it. Couple wounded. Where is Tomo? Yeah, gravely wounded. Five days, that's not bad. He, he did almost get one shot. He had like two health remaining. And Chris got pretty... He was half health. Which is pretty hair raising when you're playing Iron Man with no medic. Not advisable. But anyway, we're pretty much an end game boys. I think we're... Yeah, one day off the psionic gate. Whatever that's gonna do. And we've already got an avatar corpse. In the lab waiting for all these other things because it won't let me cut them up yet it says no you have to do all your other shadow chamber things first so in one day we get that so aside from that I don't think there's anything we got we have to do really we just have to burn a day so how are we going to burn a day oh yeah intel why not do need intel, reforge some of these contacts they've been stealing off me because I have turned down a couple of missions. I suppose if that worked, we might as well keep Excellent, it that gets Dan as promotion. Meet Colonel Dan. Excellent. He's pretty much turned into my best sniper because I spent most of this playthrough putting him through covert ops with plus aim benefits so yeah he doesn't miss often well he doesn't miss at all really alright what do we got rubbish no we don't want that no we don't really need power let's just make a PCS oh, we gotta give them a sergeant for a mobility can we do without Dragonova for a day I think we can. Seeing the Muppet. Oh, we can't negate the soldier wounding. That's alright. Seven days. Ah, we should be fine. Now, did that finish the shadow chamber? <laughs> Zero days. Come on now. There we go. What have you got to say, Doc? It mittens, man. The gateway is primed. Is the subject prepared? Ready. Oh, it is mittens, man. Oh no, it's a gremlin. It should be emitting the same signal the codex used to pass 
through the gateway. Excellent. Oh, it's a gremlin with a codex brain. We've already seen the codex opening a similar rift in the field. I am sure your device. <laughs> That's very pretty cool. Come back safe, Gremlin. Oh, Grimlix. Yeah, I'm gonna call him Grimlix. Yeah, it does. It looks exactly like the Chosen Strongholds. Yeah, it looks just like the chosen fight places. Go Grimlix! We need more info. Uh oh. Oh. Grimlix got the spit back out. There was an instant where the device was in between locations. However, once that occurred, the gateway called for a second signature, an organic signature. When we could not provide one, it generated a sort of feedback pulse. If the codex creates the door, this organic signature must surely be the key. Well, we better make sure we have the right key oh. before we try again. Looks like soldiers are going through. Excellent. Hopefully it's time to cut up Avatar Boy. Yeah. Time to cut up Avatar Boy. I'll let him talk this time. Though remarkable, it appears as if the creature were unfinished. Perhaps why we were able to ultimately defeat it. Still. We defeated it because my boys are too good. Oh. What the? I believe we have found our avatar. No crap. It's all right. Just gotta burn eight days. Who's trying to bond? Oh, Dan and Bones. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's why I did that covert ops with them. Three days, that's alright. Excellent. What are you guys? I think that's Gareth and Tammy, yep. Bond Center's busy, sorry. Is it avatar time, is it? Commander, oh, back the new facility. The we hit one of their I'm so very unconcerned. What? Is it going to blip up again straight away? Oh well. I'm still very much unconcerned. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Yeah, we're moving fast. We're cutting them up. Strategic resource located. Excellent. Resistance contacts. Nope, we've got plenty of spear ones of them. Supplies, we don't need them. Now, what continent bonus did they get off me? They got Asia. What's this one? Oh, I kind of like that one. Nice. 
nice and instant. And so I need another 40 intel. Not terribly concerned about these black sites. Oh, you gotta do these. Sabotage transmitter for. Oh, it's got the full suite. Recover item from Advent Facility. I think that's the dark event that they're preparing as well. Oh, 82 Intel. That's two more places opened up. I think we do that one. It's only nine people. 369 Sector Pod. Interesting. Very interesting. Is it A squad? Not quite. Oh, I haven't even done Dan's level yet. Where are you, Dan? What do we give you? <laughs> he could clear maps with that. Holy cow. <laughs> Absolutely clear maps. No. And now we strip everybody so we're back at square one. And this is Tammy. This is Chris. And we got a spear. What was this mission again? It was a cover item. So I think. Oh, someone's tired. Dragon. Oh, Dragon Ob has got zero days. That's rude. Kind of need someone a wee bit covert. Should I push someone in tired? Don't know about that. Well, I do have Bones to cover for him, although Bones will probably get tired from this mission. We just send in Gareth or Dan B. Oh, probably a good idea with that sector pod there, actually. Probably go with Gareth, I think. Alright, Dan's gonna be blue screening. With this beast. This beast. And bones. Gets these beasts. Alright, so there's weaponry done. Who else we need blue screening? We need crisp blue screening. Another blue screener. Yeah, let's have both. It. Oh no, Gareth can't usually hit things. Oh, should we blue screen with bones? Although that's a bit of a last resort. He's pretty close range. Could blue screen with Tammy. Well, I do prefer sticking a vest on her. Come to think of it, Chris can have his back up. What? Where's my EMP bomb? There it is. Um, is it two blue screeners? Is that enough? Because Bones needs the vest, he's always getting dinted up. Uh, Tammy needs a vest, needs to be kept safe. 
Do we vest Gareth or blue screen Gareth? <coughs> Excuse me? Um, that plated vest is probably best on bones actually. Oh no, I think we blue screen. Oh, why am I being so scared of this sector pod? Pretty much trashed it last time I ran into it. Yeah, I think we give Gareth the stasis. Oh no, back up medic. I sacrifice a grenade for it. Yeah, I think we do. Dan won't need a grenade. Just in case Hayden goes down. Into it. Get us some intel to reforge these contacts so that the council doesn't sack us. Make sure to like if you're liking the videos, fellas, and comment anything and everything. Feedback is always appreciated. And subscribe if you're new here and enjoying keeping up with the playthrough. Because there's still a bit more to come, I'd say. This bit here is just a bit wee speed bump on the way to the elders, because I think they're just around the corner. Once we figure out how to get organics through that gate, instead of poor wee Grimnicks getting spat out. This is basically A squad, so these guys are in for a world of, world of hurt. Get in there, boys. Are we concealed? Wow, it's pretty close. Sweet, we are concealed. And we're super close. Are we in the bottom right corner? We are. I do love the corners. Oh, NC fellas already. Well, I don't want to blow up the data cache. Because that would be a good grenade to say hello. Probably not just yet. I'll have to keep Chris quiet on his trigger finger. Okay. You going to activate anything? Oh, there's an Andromedon right there. Alrighty then. I wonder if I grenade them. Hmm. No, I think we set up for these guys. Understood. Moving out. Because I have a suspicion they'll be pathing back towards me. Just a wee suspicion. Oh, that's probably not a good location for them. What do we got? Alarm tower. Yes, yeah, right. Might be a bit far for Sweetie, I think. Maybe where's Dan gonna snipe from? Probably there. Well, he's got a shot on something, 100%. Is 
the Andromedon, I think. Not just yet, Dan. Hold that trigger. It's almost time. Where'd he go? Go sniff him out, Gareth. Oh, that Andromedon moved a fair distance. That's the sneaky. Let's move already. Oh, he is still there. Ah, crap. That's not cool. Thought Andromedon had moved around the corner because Gareth couldn't see him. What sort of percentages have you got? 84, 84, 50. Let's go, serial killer. This one is next, Chris. Bingo. How many is that now? That's one. But I want two from you at least. That's two. You can't handle me. No, they can't it seems. Now a coin flip. Come on, Chris. Ah, oh, missed the coin flip. That's a shame. Did I overwatch with Gareth? I did. It's a bit of a shame. We need to shred that armor. Who can shred? 74% shot. Not quite good enough. How far can you get Hayden? Probably not far enough. Oh, two more squares, but he could have done it. I think I'm going to have to do it with Sweetie. On your order. And hope he doesn't flank her. No cover or armor for you, buddy. Well, you still got a bit of armor, but not as much. And now that should be a good enough shot. Although bones can't shred. Oh, he sure packed some heat though. Oh, head trigger. Goodbye, buddy. Double crit. I love these hair triggers. And he gets an implacable. Go protect Tammy. And now Dan for the coup de gras. Yeah, I know Dan, you lo you love this part. The hundred percent shots. What have we got on Dead Eye? Ninety-five percent dead eye. Jeebus Dan. 25 damage crit. Putting you through all those covert ops for plus aim was quite a good investment, I think. Alright, so that pod should still be there. I don't think they'll be milling about. No. Oh. Is that a turret they got? Damn priesty boys. Oh, get away, civvies. You do not want to be standing in there. Oh, man. Do I just demolish his cover? Yeah, 
Yeah, I think I just demolish his cover. Let the rest of the boys sort him out. Oh, come on. He's still in cover practically. It's not ideal. Leave Hayden's action for now. Oh, Chris needs. To, where's Chris's expanded mag gone? Oh man, doing that weapon strip thing is is weird. His expanded mag beam cannon will be in the inventory. Oh, and he doesn't even. Oh, this is bad. We're green to go. Oh, hardly. You've got your wrong gun, buddy. You think you'd know your your beam cannon by now? Oh, this is tragic. Do nothing. What do you have on him? Hundred percent. That's not good enough, Dan. Although it could be good enough. Let's free up some of this cover first. Uh, yeah, that's alright sprinting with her because she gets to overwatch for free. Dan now has a new sniping position. Fifty percent crit though. That was minimum damage, I think, Dan. It's just Hayden and Bones. I think we run and gun. Is that heavy? It is. Got no cover now, do you, priesty boy? Betty stays. Oh, he dodged it. That is not cool. So what's he on? He's on... He's still on six. Hayden's gonna have to try and shoot him. What are you doing forcing our medic into taking shots? Not cool, guys. Not cool. Oh, he dodged that too. Take him out, sweetie. Nice. You're gonna stasis, aren't you, you little cheater? Yeah, you are. Who are you trying to shoot? Tammy! Incoming over here. And you're gonna try and burn bones, I'd say. Ah, but you missed. Whoa. Is getting close here. Sucks to be you. Right, six turns to get there. Right, poor Chris. Finally. I hope those civvies got out of the way. <laughs> Otherwise, they're gonna become collateral. Oh, crap. I think he crit the sh stasis priest, though. Do I just grenade again? Six to seven. Yeah, I think I do. It should kill all of them bar the priest. Yeah, and the civvies live. Excellent. Now this is what we do with priests. Oh no. What do you mean? Where? 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 Oh, crap. Oh, shit. Oh, and turrets. It gets better. Wow. 
All I wanted to do was execute the stasis priest. Alright, we got a... You're blue screening, right? Can't miss this, Dan. No two ways about it. Excellent. Hack defense decrease. Come on, sweetie. See if we can take over a sector pot after blue screening him. Think I've invested enough in her hack. Oh, I can shut him down with a coin flip, basically. 28% <laughs> is a bit too much to go for. Oh no! Okay, that's bad. I should have blue screened him again. So we got left. Just hating them bones. Okay, this is not good. Not good, guys. Not gonna lie. Oh, he can haywire as well. It's a long shot. Because his hex is nowhere near as good as Tammy's. 44, come on, roll well, Hayden. Oh, yes. He's shut down. Whew. Oh. Hayden, the medic, comes through with the clutch. Excellent. So we got just bones <laughs> activating all those people. Um. I kind of wanted to overwatch to kill this priest, but now if I leave him open... Although that's a shield bearer, he's just going to shield. And he's just going to try and flamethrower. Uh, it's going to be a risk. Come on, Bladestorm and Bones. Teach him not to run from you. No, don't overwatch! Where's your Bladestorm? Yeah, I did. You were supposed to use your sword. I've got it. Oh, that is not cool, Bones. That was a blade storm, not a Overwatch. Oh, at least he's got Untouchable. And this Goober should just shield. Yep, you're too predictable, buddy. Oh, no cover for Bones. Oh, crap. Oh, well, there's some work for Hayden. Right. Tammy with her free overwatches. Can Chris get... Oh, so he won't be able to use it. Oh, he can. Just. His bone's out of that radius, though. He is. Get some shred going, Bones. That should still shred through his shield, right? I hope so. Yeah. Sweet. Now uh, we'll save that. What do we got? Chain shot and rupture and suppression. Seventy-eight percent. Yeah, I want that sector pod dead. Oh, come on, Chris. No, that was highly disappointing. Uh, I don't think Gareth has salvo. No, he doesn't, so we can move him. 
hopefully get that trooper in the blast radius yep continue shredding this damn sector pod excellent who we got left oh you gotta reload but you do it for free What do you got on your dead eye on him? 84% to kill him. Let's do it. Oh yeah. Right between the eyes. And what's that purifier on? Can Bones take that trooper? Might be able to. Oh no, he needs healed. Um, On my way. So we definitely heal him, I think. Go heal him. Now, what to do? What to do? Where? Oh, that turret as well. Can't forget about that. So we should be able to kill him from a safe distance. Giving us an implacable move. Oh, and a hair trigger. Not too shabby at all. Can the turret still shoot him from there? Now if I... So he's still got his implacable move, so surely... No, I think this takes the place of my implacable move. Do I just go into the... He nah, because he'll just flank. I think the turret can shoot me from there. Whatever you say. So there's your hair trigger move. You should still have another action. 89% on him. Why not? Deep bones. Oh, the one shot crit. Holy cow, bones. Why, why do I bother sending other troops with you? Oh, Hayden took a scratch. Shut that thing down, sweetie. We're not gonna let it shoot bones and uh, shoot Hayden and get away with it. Yeah, I don't want to take it over. No shooting my people. <laughs> Chris, because he's got his wrong gun, he's a bit behind. Just a wee bit behind. I think that's every unit killed apart from this turret though. Oh, still got Gareth. He's lagging up a bit too. Oh, and Bones can probably just get it and finish the objective. Yeah, grab it. Or do you have to hack it? <laughs> Bones isn't known for his for his hacking prowess. <laughs> Had 
Lopez was demonstrated. Psychological restraint data. Yeah, Bones doesn't know what to do with that. Oh, we're sweet. Dunsky. These sector pods aren't so much of an issue. Not when you have a sniper with like 110 aim or whatever ridiculous number he has. Don't know about Chris bringing his wrong beam cannon though. Remember to like if you like in the videos guys. Comment anything and everything. And subscribe if you're enjoying the playthrough. I really do appreciate all of it. But if you've followed this far, I must be entertaining. So I raise my glass to you. My glass of water. <laughs> Slightly longish one this time, fellas. 41. Oh, 2 and 6. And a bit of fatigue. That's alright. Oh, sick the pod wreck. Hello, Commander. Excellent. Excellent. Well, yeah, we're over 40 minutes, guys, but I won't split this one. I'll just cut it here. There's a nice little jutter bar on the way to our avatar autopsy. Oh, at two days. So, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you drop in those likes and comments and subscribes if you're enjoying the playthrough. And I'll catch you on the flip side.